Haley, if I fall, you're gonna catch me? Um, you're probably too heavy. I mean, I'm your dad, you know. You got me, Haley? Yep. Winter is coming and it's coming fast. It's time we get this chicken coop moved while we still can. We figured we'd put it close to the house and next to the sheep pen to make winter chores less of a chore.
job on. We only got 500 more to go. We're going to be using some of our leftover Reflectix bubble foil insulation that we purchased last year for our off-grid cabin. With the clear side of the coupe allowing sunlight in, it will also add heat as this will help hold it to a comfortable temp during the winter and also keep some heat out during the summer months as well. So there's a vent up there. That's where all the smell will escape from. They need to be well vented, but this stuff right here will keep the steel from turning this place into a giant ice box. This actually will help keep the heat in that comes from the composted bedding and the chicken's body heat all together. that from the outside once we finally get some trim on. You don't want none of this blowing across your chickens. That's what will get them cold and sick and dead. Me and Autumn are cold, and um, it's getting dark. We're losing daylight, aren't we? Mm -hmm. Can't hardly see you anymore.
girls all look all warm and cuddly up in here, don't you? I'm using a log skinning tool, also known as a draw knife, to round the edges of my rough cut 2x4s for our chickens' perches. It just seems like it'd be a bit more comfortable on their feet while roosting all night. So I'm putting all these perches up here, almost in like a circle, a huddle up circle. So they're going to be here. All down here, here. So they're all gonna be in a circle right next to each other, helping keeping each other warm. Should hold quite a few birds. Six and a half. Not yet, chickies. Under there? Oh, look at that! You pretty girl. We'll just let you lay there for a while. Okay. We're here for this. Now the chickens will be in here full time, I need to get my hardware cloth supports up so predators don't get in.
the weirdest chicken you ever seen? So it's been a couple days now since we've done this work to the chicken coop. We, we do know that we need to put a cover over this, over the nesting boxes, because they're roosting up on here and uh, pooping in the nesting boxes. So you gotta clean that out like daily. So we did end up putting another perch right here. That way they just got one more spot. We'll probably add some more, who knows, we'll see. Next thing I need to do is make a uh, inside door handle latch. Keep this shut because if you leave it cracked open, the chickens might get out. And I need to make a latch on the outside. I just haven't done that yet. I bought a nice old fashioned uh, handle for the outside, but it uh, doesn't work the way I have it set up. So I need to figure something else up. So the wife and kids were canning some apples, so we always save our food scraps and our organic food scraps. We, we save them and then we just give them to the chickens. This will all be a nice compost pile by the time spring gets here. We can pile this whole area up and then we can move our mobile chicken coop back into the pasture and start moving them daily come springtime on fresh grass. So you might be wondering why we didn't put a wall right here. We actually did plan on putting a wall here and insulating it all, having a door that we can walk through so we can clean out this side if we need to, so we can access the other end and put in a little chicken door in the middle there. But we decided not to do that because we're hoping with these clear panels out here that uh, sunlight will come in and it'll actually help heat this side that is insulated. So. Like I mentioned in the video, we put this stuff up because it will keep the body heat in and it'll keep the steel roofing tin from turning this place into a giant freezer. Because when that stuff freezes, it'll make it colder in here than it is outside in the winter time when you don't want that. So this stuff right here will keep all the heat inside. <laughs> 